I really look like a true king using this operator skin. Just look at me. It's fresh. Pacers. Easy money! You legit spit out diamonds, rubies, and gold, bro. So uh, what's up guys, it's Terry here by New York Quadji and welcome back to another video of Call of Duty, Modern Warfare 2 Multiplayer, and Warzone 2. In today's video, we got a very special store bundle known as the Tracer Pack Champs Bundle for the CDL of 2023. And yeah, it came out 30 minutes later than the usual bundle refresh update, which is really weird, but it finally dropped. And as you guys can see, you get a really crazy operator skin that has a crown on it. You basically become the king or scump, I guess you could say. It comes with tracers for the M4 and tracers for the MCPR, which we've already seen before, including gold tracers and Fontania as well. So it looks like it's just another gold pack. I feel like they're spamming too much gold lately, but regardless, I'm gonna check out these tracers, check out the dismemberment, see how the operator skin looks like in game. If you guys are ready for all of that and anything secretive about this bundle you guys should know, make sure you guys drop a like in the video, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications. I upload store bundle videos pretty often on this channel, so like tracer packs that interest me, reactive skins, operator bundles, or whatever the case may be. And if you enjoy Warzone 2 gameplay and the occasional new slash update video every so often, you've come to the right channel. Go ahead and subscribe if you want, I'm just glad that you're even here. But without further ado, let's go ahead and check out this bundle, shall we? So first off, we got the CDL Male Home King Operator skin, which comes with the finishing move of Lights Out. And this dude legit is a king. You will legit just be the the, the king of COD running this, this, this freaking Operator skin. And he looks pretty fresh. He's got a nice little, like, uh like king's coat or whatever on his back which i think it looks really nice actually and uh just i think he looks great i mean this is if you want to look like a king hey put, go ahead and put this operator skin on i think it looks pretty great just personally next up we got the gold tracer blueprint of the m4 known as diamonds and as you guys can see it has gold flakes slash riches tracers and spontaneous wealth death effect we can see that the tracers are pretty much gold and it's like an actual dismemberment kind of like how we saw with the damascus heat yesterday so turn your enemies literally into gold which i think is kind of cool uh, as you guys can see you cannot put these tracers on any other gun because it doesn't have an ammunition so that means don't put an ammunition you'll keep the tracers no matter what class it'll be running this but uh it's legit a diamond camo which is pretty fresh i kind of just wish they had diamond in the game just because um it's a lot more cleaner than platinum but hey I'll take it. Next up, we got the Rubies MCPR 300, and it also comes with Gold Flake and Riches Tracers and the Spontaneous Wealth. And once again, if you look at the preview, you guys can see that it uh, it pretty much has the same effect. Really, really dope. Uh, just Gold Tracers, I guess you could say. And it has a really nice look. Oh, this one actually comes with 0.300 mag high velocity ammunition. So there is a chance that we could put this ammunition on other guns. So if I find that the other snipers can run this, I'll let you guys know, uh, you know, later on here in the video what, what snipers you can actually put it on. But really cool that it comes with ammunition, so there's a chance it could actually be put on other weapons, which is awesome. Really clean look, by the way. And uh, let me know if you guys want to see, like, a rubies camo in the game. I think that'd be pretty cool. Next up, we got the Weapon Charm with the Crown, the Take the Throne Large Decal. You guys know I love some decals. Another one weapon sticker, the Watch and Learn Emblem, the I Am Supreme Emblem, the Chase the Bag calling card, and the Take the L calling card, which actually has a, a shipment uh, background, which is kind of cool. So all this for 2400 COD points, I think it's kind of a W. I like the decal, I like the M4, I like the operator skin, I like the decal I, said, I think I said already, and some of these customizations are pretty cool. So uh, if you're interested in that, then go for it, but it does suck that it's another M4 tracer when it could have been like maybe Attack 56, or a Vaznev or something else. We've already seen too many M4s and I think we've seen an MCPR before as well, but oh well. Let's go ahead and check this bundle out and see what tracers you can put onto other weapons from the sniper rifle. Let's rock and roll. I really look like a true king using this operator skin. Just look at me, it's fresh. So here we are with the Diamonds M4 and the Rubies MCPR 300. And before moving on with these weapons, I do wanna sadly say that for some reason, even though you can technically put the high velocity ammunition on the LAB 330 and the SPX 80 here, as you guys can see, even when you click on the skins, it doesn't pop up. So I don't know if this is a bug. I don't know if they're intentionally doing this so we can't put traces on these snipers. But by definition, because they have the same ammunition as the MCPR, tracers should be able to be extended to the lab 330 and the spx 80 but unfortunately you can't even when you put on the ammunition 
if you shoot with either weapon, uh, you can't put on the ammo, so... I don't know if this is a bug. I think we've had a similar uh, effect to this before in a previous Tracer back from like season one or season two. I can't remember, but it's really annoying how they share the same ammunition and I feel like you should be able to put Tracers on these guns just because aren't they in the same platform too? No, they aren't. But still, I feel like they should be able to share ammo just because there's the same ammunition. But yeah, you can't put Tracers on any other gun in the game. It's only going to be for the MCPR 300 and the M4. Moving onwards though, let's go ahead and check out the decal and see how it looks like uh, on this weapon. So as you guys can see, the decal is actually pretty huge and it looks actually pretty nice on the on the M4. So I'm gonna go ahead and keep it on. Actually, I'll take it off for now. Uh, but you guys can see that it looks pretty good on, on I, I imagine, a lot, a lot of weapons. But let's go ahead and see how the camos look like on this weapon. So here's the base camos and how they look like. They really don't cover the gun at all because the diamond is kind of in the way. So here's how gold looks like. You basically have a gold diamond gun, which looks clean. Here is Platinum. A Platinum Diamond is pretty amazing. Here's Polyatomic, which is a Polyatomic Diamond. And Orion, which has Orion and obviously a Diamond mixed in. I think the best one is probably either going to be Polyatomic or probably Platinum. Platinum looks really nice with Diamond. Let's give us a Diamond Camo, please. And then here is how the Speckled Camo looks like. I actually like the look of that a lot. And then here is how the Painted Pig looks like. Nothing too crazy. And here are the Solid Color Camos. And it actually changes the color of the diamond as well. That's pretty clean. This is pretty goaded. For an M4 blueprint, this is probably one of the best blueprints you can buy just because of all the customization options you can put on there. Here are the CDL camos, very similar uh, in terms of effects. And then the event camos got the bowing blossoms looking beautiful. Uh, Dark bones, went to Vash. Galvanic is kind of trash on this one. You know what? Pretty funny actually. Uh, Pure poison looks really good. And yeah, bowing, bowing blossoms is just a clean camo, but. Honestly, W Blueprint, one of the best blueprints for sure. And then moving onwards, we got the MCPR 300 rubies. And I can't wait to see how this looks like. Here's the base camels. They actually changed with the, the blueprint very well. Here's how gold looks like. Just a like diamond gold or ruby gold. Here we got platinum with the platinum rubies. Here we got polyatomic with the platinum rubies. And then we got Orion with, uh, with the rubies, which actually looks kind of clean. I think Orion looks the best out of all of them, just personally. Uh, moving onwards, we got the yellow speckled camo and combining it with rubies. I think the M4 looks a lot better uh, than than the MCPR 300 when it comes to this. Ooh, when you put on charcoal, it kind of reminds me of the uh, MW19 gold camo. Solid color camos are kind of cool on this weapon, but I still think they look better on the M4. The M4 just has, has a clean design. Here's the CDL camos, the event camos. Can't forget about Bowing Blossom, of course. And then uh, Galvanic camo actually looks pretty fresh on this one, too. And there you go. So pretty W blueprints in my opinion. I think the M4 looks a little bit better though. Now I'm gonna show you guys how the guns look like with their meta attachments to see if they're worth, you know, running. So here's the base blueprint attachments for the Diamonds M4. And here is the meta class setup for the Diamonds M4. So what sucks is that you do lose a lot of the look of the gun, which is uh, kind of sucky, but you could put on, you know, some camos maybe to kind of make up for it. You know, at least you still have the diamonds, you know, supposedly. You know, you're gonna have to like really sacrifice a lot, but you'll still have the base main look of the diamonds, just not on the barrel or the mag or anything else. So it's up to you. Here are the base blueprint attachments for the Ruby's MCPR 300. And here's the meta class setup and the meta attachments for the MCPR 300. And pretty much it, it retains its look. It's going to look beautiful with these attachments and you'll be able to quick scope opponents very easily. So at least it looks a lot better at the M4 in that sense. And you don't need to put on like a camo or anything like that, but yeah. I believe that's everything that I need to show off here in the menus. Here's the operator skin. And now we're gonna go into a game, show off the tracers and the dismemberment and all that. And uh, maybe see the operator in third person as well. So hope you guys enjoy, let's rock and roll. Okay, so here we are with the Diamonds M4, and man, this joint, like, looks really, really clean. I can't even lie, like, that's a little gold M4 iron sight, and we've got the Rubies MCPR 300. I still kind of wish it was for different guns, but these are pretty clean blueprints, if I do say so myself. With all that being said, let's go ahead and check out the Tracers. You legit spit out diamonds, rubies, and gold, bro! <laughs> Yo, can I see like what what do the the coins say? I'm kind of curious now. Oh, it's like uh, pictures of like of, of a, like a tiger or a cat or something. That's kind of fresh. I can't even lie. Like that's that's actually really cool. And the gold stays on the wall, bro. 
that these are some really great tracers. Whoever decided like work on these, bro, like yo, super freaking W. Legitimately, like actually W, bro. This is actually one of the coolest tracer effects ever. So, yeah, legit all riches that rich people would have. You are going to be balling with this sort of freaking bundle. And now let's see how these traces look like real quick. Yeah, I guess he just spits out diamond and you see the uh, the diamonds on the wall. That's pretty crazy. I'm gonna get a better look though. Let's see how the legs look like real quick. Okay, so it always goes to the head and it basically like just, uh, you know, you get a whole bunch of like rubies on them. Just wanna see it one more time real quick. And yeah, just just legit, just a whole bunch of freaking money and wealth and everything comes out of the, the person, which is pretty crazy. And now let's see the MCPR 300 real quick. Oh yeah, a whole bunch of gold, money, trash, whatever the case may be. It's a lot more apparent with the M4 because you obviously shoot a lot faster, but uh, it's still a pretty cool effect overall. And now let's go ahead and show you guys the finishing move that this bundle comes with. The uh, lights out, pretty freaking W right there. Now we're gonna see what happens when they're laying down. Oh, that's pretty tight. I kind of like that was kind of cool. And now we're gonna see what happens when they're laying down. <laughs> oh my goodness. And you see the freaking like coins pop out. So yeah, those are the finisher moves. Those are the tracer effects. Uh, I'm gonna switch to my meta class setup to show you guys that I can have traces on my blueprints no matter what class setup I use, as long as I don't change the ammunition. As long as you don't add an ammunition to the M4. As you can see, I still have traces on my own M4 class. And as long as you don't change the high velocity ammunition from the uh, MCPR 300, you'll keep it. I might have changed it on my my uh my rubies basically don't touch it because i believe i took it off for a second to kind of check out the tracers but if you take it off like you're gonna have to like re-put on the the ammunition or like re-put put on the blueprint if you want to keep the traces like legit don't even touch the ammunition and you should be able to use the mcpr 300 with any class of it. but but uh yeah i'm gonna go to third person view real quick and show you guys the uh the skin a little bit Okay, and here we are with the third person view of the king skin and this is legit a really fire skin You will definitely stand out with your crown and everything People will know that you spent 20 bucks on this bundle You didn't even have to play rank play or anything like that You know who needs this sweat to earn a reward when you could just spend $20 for like basically the ba best reward in the game <laughs> I don't know. I just find that fun kind of funny like they should have made this like a top 250 skin or something just personally, but Yeah, I think this bundle is pretty cool I'm not like crazy crazy about it, but I love the M4. Like if you've never gotten an M4 blueprint before, this is a pretty W blueprint. The MCPR is pretty W as well with all the camos. The decal is fire. Uh, the only thing that's sucky is that we've already had traces of these guns before. So if you bought one before, you, it might not be worth it. Uh, the, the skin is cool. I just wish I had a little bit more pizzazz to it. Maybe like a glowing effect would be kind of cool. Like, like a Super Saiyan kind of effect, if you know what I'm getting at, Supersonic. Uh, and then I wish the tracers of the MCPR actually transferred to other snipers. Like, why don't they transfer? They're all running 300 high ammunition, freaking high velocity ammunition. I, I don't know. But, eh, it, it's, it's, you know, is it a W or an L? That's obviously in your eyes to, to determine that. But, uh, yeah. I'll be, I'm going to be using the M4 on my main channel, getting some MGBs with it. So make sure you guys check that out. And make sure you guys drop a like in the video, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications if you guys enjoyed this bundle review. I'll be make sure I'll be making sure to you know review more bundles in the future. We still got another three thousand COD point bundle to review very soon, and uh, yeah, just keep being big ballers. I really freaking love you all, and let me know what you guys thought about this bundle in the comments section below. I love you all. Amen.